need a CTO? You know, everyone says, find your technical co-founder. You can't do this without them. But, you know, it's the age of AI and it's 2025. Is that still the case? Yeah, it's a timing issue. So we have to kind of think about what CTO really is. Mm -hmm. um, CTO is a person that um, manages a team of developers and, you know, they put process in place. They look at the architectural side of things. So if you're an, an, at an early stage where you're building out an idea or you're trying to validate an idea, to try to even go into the thinking of getting a CTO is almost like trying to kind of like be an adult while you're still a, while you're still a child, right? So, so it's kind of jumping the gun there. Um, now there's many, many ramifications. And so I think one of the things that people can think about is what happened if you get someone when you don't need them mm -hmm. versus, you know, all the opposite, right? When you need them, but you don't get them. Now the early stage is usually that you want to be careful of not getting someone when you don't need them because, mm -hmm. You know, there's a cost associated with everything, as I mentioned last time. I think in the AI age, the even the tech co-founder part can be postponed in some ways. You can get someone who knows technical to come and help you on things that maybe AI cannot help you with, but you don't ne necessarily make them the co-founder. So I'm not saying that you don't get someone involved that knows technology uh, early on. What I'm saying is that don't get them involved at such a deep like level right away. Because getting a co-founder is more than just someone with technical knowledge. They have to share your values. You have to be able to you know, like tolerate them and vice versa. And when there's conflict, how do you? So there's a lot of things you have to work through to know if that person should be a co-founder or not. So I would say, yeah, early stage, definitely CTO is way too early because you're still a, a child and you need to prove out the product idea before you form a team, and then that's when you need to code a CTO to manage them.